It's a bumbly night in Peacefulburg. I mean, it's a peaceful night in Bumblyburg. The city's resident hero is on patrol. Ever vigilant, ever watchful, ever Larry Boy. Hey, Archie, lights are still on at the Daily Bumble. Oh, it's just Bob putting the paper to bed. And there's Vicky. <sighs> Only the cutest cuke in town. You know, I think Vicky just might go to the Founders Day dance with you this year, if you'd get up the nerve to ask her. Oh yeah, like that'll happen, Arch. When pigs fly. On the wing? What's going on here? Could this be the nefarious plot spawned by the diabolical team up of Larry Boy's arch enemies, Greta Von Gruesome, Awful Alvin, and Lampy? Ho <laughs> ho! My awful plan of villainous villainy is working to perfection! Your plan? You mean my plan to distract Larry Boy while we break into the Bumbleberg science labs? I believe that now is the time when we should perform the villainous dance of villainy! Dance with me, Lampy! I gave up telemarketing for this. Sure look bad for Larry Boy. But wait, who is this cute little guy? Uh, oh, I, I mean, who is this uh, handsome, oh so dashing superhero? I am the Dark Crow. Don't even think it, Larry Boy. Remember, you bruise easily. Superhero great from Bumbleburg's neighboring town of Lolly Haven. Hello, Larry boy. Go home, get some rest, because this case, I want to tell you something, is not big enough for the two of us. <gasps> A little canola oil and. Yep, good as new. Oops. Ah! into those pigs. Otherwise, you might have had a cow full of bacon, huh, Dark Crow? <laughs> Are you kidding me? They never would have stood a chance against the Dark Crow. Wow, his own theme music. Uh, Laddie boy, there's been a break-in at the Bumbleberg Science Labs. Uh, you'd better check it out. A break-in at the Bumbleberg Science Labs. It must be Awful Alvin and his team of fiends. Those flying pigs were simply a big fat distraction to keep us muy ocupado. Right. Let's go get them. Let us go get them? The Dark Crow needs help from no vegetable. Ah, uh, DC? Can I catch a ride? My Larry plane's gonna be in the shop a while. How is this telescope going to help us crack open the Mega Vault? Lampy isn't just here for his pretty face and smooth dance steps. He also has his own superpowers. I call this one the Lampy Laser. Whoop. 
Not entirely. This loose cord is a safety hazard. A good superhero always takes time to prevent accidents. No! Thanks, Larry Boy. We couldn't have escaped without you. You're welcome. Oh, wait. You're not welcome. Now that we have this, we'll be unstoppable! <laughs> ooh, ooh, I can feel another villainy dance coming on! Oh, give it a rest! Later, after pulling themselves from the sticky scientific goo, Larry Boy and Dark Crow free the scientists. I've got sticky scientific goo in my underpants. Professor, what is that device they stole? Oh, yes. It's an over-easy egg ray. It turns any inanimate object into over-easy eggs. They couldn't turn a cow into over-easy eggs, could they? No. Because cows are alive. Yah, yah. What about a wooden cow? <sighs> All right. The ray could work on a wooden cow. <sighs> because wooden cows aren't alive, are they? <sighs> so, what you are saying, Professor, is that they will be able to turn almost anything into big, over-easy eggs? But not cows! No, no not, not cows! cows. The next night at Superhero Class, Larry Boy and Dark Crow tried to sit as far apart as possible. Superheroes, there are times when you will have to work as a team. Together, you can accomplish many things you cannot do alone. Larry Boy equals stinkiness? Take, for instance, one of Bumpkin's vines. Good for snaring a villain or tripping up an evildoer. But if I stack these heavy books on one vine, it cannot hold them. <laughs> but together, these vines are strong enough to hold the books. Master? Um, what if the town that's under your sworn protection is invaded by an overgrown seedless grape? Who are you calling seedless? You both need to hear the words of my lesson. Heroes? Turn your superhero handbooks to section 21, paragraph 4, subsection 9, and 10. Two are better than one because they have a good return for their labor. For if either of them falls, the one will lift up his companion. When two work together, they are stronger than one. The next day, the staff of the Daily Bumble newspaper visits a new exhibit at the Bubbly Bird Museum of History and really old stuff. Wow, this new exhibition on the ancient pharaohs is great! I'm getting so many good photos! Here, take this shot. My headline can be, Me and My Mummy. Uh, that's fine for the school paper, Junior, but it's not the kind of story that sells in Bumbleburg. I, I wish something exciting would happen around here. Concrete walls cannot keep us out now that we have the power of the over-easy egg ray. Prepare to fire! <gasps> the wall, it's turning into over-easy eggs! <gasps> 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 The forbidden 
treasures of the Bumblebee Museum of History and the really old stuff are now ripe for the taking! You'll never get away with this! Larry Boy will stop you! Oh, Lampy! Doesn't this villainy just make you feel like dancing? One more dance step, and I'll serve you on toast with a side of bacon. Now this is what I call news. If I could get free, I could snap a front page photo of the villains. I wonder what's in here. I hope it's filled with diamonds, or rubies, or a fondue set. I love fondue. Prepare to eat crowbar! On guard! Oh, stay out of my way, lady boy! I told you, this is my case! I don't have to! Look out! Oh. Oh. Here. Oh, we're gone! Vicky, I want to ask you something about the Founder's Day dance. Yes, Larry boy? What is it? Um, this year, are they gonna have refreshments? You know, like hot fudge sundaes at the dance? Did you say dance? I was born to dance. <laughs> You mind? Yoo-hoo! I thought you might like to know that you're about to become victims of a concentrated blast of pure villainy! Your over-easy egg rig cannot hurt us! <laughs> We're not wooden cows! Eh, uh, right. Uh, but it will work quite nicely on your super costumes! Better cheesh your super costumes. Goodbye. Cheesh, <laughs> 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 that's a good one. The Dark Crow will stop your costume, or no? Uh. You two super losers, let us go about our villainous villainy, or the newspaper gal gets egged! Larry Boy! With the egg timer running out on Vicky and on the safety of all Bumbleberg, Larry Boy and Dark Crow wipe the egg off their faces and get back to work. These costumes won't exactly strike fear into the hearts of evildoers. Greta and Awful Alvin have Vicky. We don't have time to be concerned about fashion. Our heroes return to the lab to seek help from Professor Flurbleblub. <laughs> 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 After they stop laughing at their new costumes. Well, we may have a way to help. The over-easy egg ray gun is made from the only substance strong enough to resist the ray's power. That is why the ray gun itself does not turn into over-easy eggs, yes? Yeah, it's made from organium. And we have used the same metal to create this. The Ponybot 3000, the ultimate in over-easy egg ray fighting technology. But why is it shaped like a bunny? Well, we think bunnies are real cute. There's only one problem. We only had enough Aganium to make one bunny bot. You'll have to share. Share? No hip-hopping bunny trailing way. This is my case. And it's my city. <sighs> you know, you're right. Your shoes aren't tight. Hey, I'm not wearing any shoes. I don't even have feet. It is such a conundrum, no? Adios, amigo. Vicky, have no fear. The Dark Crow is coming to save you.
Meanwhile, the villains were floating around town, turning things into wags, just because they could, and just because they were bad. <laughs> I simply love being bad. It makes me shimmy all over. I shimmy with badness. Look, up in the sky. It's a vetter balloon. It's a metallic flying fish. Whoa! It's a cucumber wearing pajamas attached to a funny shaped robot. It's Larry Boy. Hulk villains. Your days of foul deeds are basically over. Don't you mean all that easy? What? How can this be? Looks like you're heading to the hothouse, my friends, to do some hard-boiled time out. It's my turn to use the bunny butt. You gotta fly in here. Oh, please. You got to fly here. That doesn't count. I've got an awful idea. But it should be my turn because I... Well, good morning, Eggy Heads. Welcome to my secret lair! Don't worry, Vicky. I'll get us out of this. You? Ha! I once again laugh in your vegetable face. Only a fruit like me can save us now. I'm afraid no one can save you. For you see, with just a flip of the switch, the over-easy egg ray turns that sphinx into a big glop of eggs, which will plop down into the skillet. You're about to become the world's biggest superhero and Vicky Omelette! Okay, see how you mess up my plans. Make me wear paper bags over my head. My anger for you is enraging largely as we speak, mi amigo. What about the way you try and take over my superhero territory? And the girl I'm inviting to the Founders Day dance? Vicky, tell him that. The Dark Crow is your favorite. Both of you, stop it! Look! Say goodbye forever! No! I, Awful Alvin, the most awful mind of our time, should be allowed to finish them off. Nine! I waited too long for this moment to let a smelly little onion flip the switch. Such an awful deed as this should only be done by the most awful villain. And I could out awful you with one root behind my back. You know, if they just quit arguing, they could have finished us off by now. Yeah, they would both get what they want if only they'd work together. When two work together, they are stronger than one. What are we doing? We should have been working together. Side by side, mi amigo. Okay, okay. Uh, why don't we vote on who gets to throw the switch? Fine. But Lapis vote doesn't count. Oh, of course it counts. He's heating the skillet. Guys, I, I think if we can bump the telescope just right, we might have a chance. You know, you're pretty smart for someone who's never been to a superhero class. <gasps> ah! They're escaping! It's your turn, Larry Boy. I did get to fly it here, after all. <laughs> Shouldn't there be an eject button? Hang on, Larry boy! Blam! 
me! What are you doing? Let me go! Just working with you, partner. Let's stop Greta Von Grusom together. Sorry, boys. You missed! <laughs> Evil doers. This time things didn't turn out sunny side up for you. And so, with the villainous threesome safely in jail, Larry Boy and Dark Crow return the over easy egg ray to the Bumbleberg Science Labs. We want you all to know we did this together as a team. Because when two people work together, they're more powerful than either one of them is alone. Oh, I can see the headline now. Teamwork tosses bad guys salad. Or, 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 united we stand. Divided, who we get egg on our faces. Was there something you wanted to ask me about Founders Day, Larry Boy? Oh, wow. John Blank's here. Didn't you want to ask me to the Founders Day dance, Larry Boy? Oh, right. I'd love to go with you. Wow. Maybe we could go have a nice dinner together first. Wait for me, Larry boy. We are some team, are we not? We must do everything together now. I will show you how to dance because I am the Dark Crow. I have a very talented choreographer as you should meet. She does all my music. And this, superheroes, is how we trap three supervillains in one fell swoop. Now, before we adjourn, I need one superhero for an assignment. Do I have a volunteer? Oh, oh, pick me! Pick me! Ah, Larry Boy. Yes. <laughs> Ready, willing, and able for my assignment, Master Joy. Larry Boy, your eagerness will help you with your task. I would like you to clean these erasers. <gasps> Class dismissed. Uh, Larry boy want to come to amusement park? Oh yes, why don't you join us once you finish? Sure, once I finish. What would you like to do first, Electromelon? Bumper cars! Tisk tisk. Oops.
Right. Me sorry. Yeah. 